What is up everybody, Mikey Derpanzi here with Hearts of Iron 4 with the greatest encirclement the world has ever seen. They are all going to die very shortly because, well, because we're going, they have no supplies. They're in just the, the steppes of Central Asia. They, they, they are doomed. You must realize, General Kenobi, you are doomed. Oh, I don't think so. Also, Italy is, um... There's just so many divisions in Italy. Can we nuke them yet? We cannot. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. Uh, Croatia. What the hell are you doing? Uh, boy, can you take this stuff? Because... The, you're leaving us exposed if you don't. Oh, Lord have mercy. They have, like, no one left here. Can we push across? Not quite, because it's... Because it's a level 10 sea fort. It's a level 8 coastal fort. It's a big-time coastal fort. To get into Crimea. Crimea River. Oh, just look at it crumble! Keep them, keep them at bay. I don't know where the hell you are going, but they're just all doomed. Wow. This is a me this is a mess of battle plans and whatnot. So I don't exactly know what's going on, but it's doing okay. Okay, make sure you take all of this stuff too. All these random, like, extra islands and everything. So, Italy. Italy can't be far away from Serenity. I mean, we're... We're, atta we're attacking Genoa. If we take Genoa, if Italy surrenders, we'll have a gateway into Germany. So, what you're telling me is they're not guarding everything? Interesting. You should have a little bit of fun and uh, make some progress while you're at it. Speaking of progress, in terms of equipment, still need more Sparty, which we'll see if we ever actually get it. Fighting for Genoa. If, you, if Genoa, I mean. Italy? 97%. Gotta get... Holy shice. Okay. Um, let's do another Sparty. In terms of ships. Okay. Um, First Fleet, 21 destroyers. What does the second fleet need? The second fleet needs... 31 destroyers. 19... Plus one is 20. 31 destroyers. 31 destroyers for the second fleet. Destroyers. Second fleet. 10, 20, 31. Go for it. Boy. Wait, what? Oh. So I'll say, why are you not doing it? Because you kind of have to tell them to sign all the factors. They just don't automatically do it because, you know, not all nations are 1954 Japan. Oh God, we just oh we just nuked Belgrade. Like anytime the anytime my allies use a nuclear weapon, I'm like, oh no, what is going on? This is barbaric. So we've got these encirclements, right? Ooh, so I hear you. Ooh, encirclement for your encirclement. So I, so we got more encirclements. Yeah, we truly just do not have anything else left to research. So we're going to have to redraw some front lines. But that'll be... I'll, that, that, I'll be more than okay with that. Because, well, you know, it's all for a good reason. So America, you're going to kill them, right? You're going to wipe them out. All of them. So, we've kind of run into a little stagnation up here. 
up at the top of Italy, but that's fine because well, the rest of Italy. I mean, all we gotta do is take one more. If we drop a nuke on Italy. Oh, we own Genoa. What the hell? Pause, pause, pause. What? Do, okay, so we have. We need. We still need more Sparty. See more naval bombers. We need tactical bombers. Let's uh, throw another. Let's throw another tin up at tactical bombers. Also, considering they're all broken, it doesn't really matter. Save private. Save private Ryan, please. Yeah, can y'all please go do that? Meanwhile, the rest of you need to destroy this encirclement. Like, it really does make my heart heavy how many casualties we're inflicting. Like, I know it's just a game, but still. Thank God, thank God IRL the Allies won. I mean, not just for democracy and, you know, my grandparents, like, grandfather surviving and all that, but literally just the amount of people that would have died. Like, not many are going to be left after this. So. Is this a cold area? I could nuke. I could nuke a lot of this. I can't nuke anything in the Alpine region. Which would allow me to force Italy to surrender. Can I nuke Crimea? No, I can't. Because it's in the Ukraine. And we're not able to go to the Ukraine yet. Or not. We don't have air superiority in the Ukraine yet. So I'll go there. That kind of looks like a dick. So there we go. Getting all those encirclements. We're definitely going to redraw some front lines. Between this episode and the next. But of course... For now, for now we're doing this. Okay. So what do we do? Do we do like, we probably do is we have move a whole five here, five to five armies here. And then we have probably the other eight push through Russia. Because I mean, most of their stuff's here. Most of their stuff, it, we're losing Sparty faster than we're gaining it. So that's not good. Not at all. I mean, we are taking Italy. Slowly but surely, we are taking over Italy. How on earth do we just... We're low on aluminum? Really? Okay. Sure. Dares wins. Yeah, we definitely need more troops here. How have we not taken out and taken them out yet? Italy is Oh my god. So we're fueling our conquest with all of this stuff. We need more jet fighters. We need no. We, we need more Sparty. We need. Well, I guess we can do more Sparty and more jet fighters, and more jet fighters. Oh boy. Um. America, we need all your stuff. Should let this reset for a little bit. We took over Italy. Oh my God. They're like kind of securing all of this, which is good and bad. Unfortunately, this counts as all of their stuff. So Italy is toast. Can I not make it? If I can make it across just with that, that one division. I know they have a fort. I know they have air support and everything, but please just go away. Anyhow, I kind of want some troops to push out from Italy. Like, the Balkans are great and all, but, like, 
we'd really need Hungary to surrender. Uh, and from Italy, we can push through to France and Spain. But the Alps are a pain. The Alps are a pain. Okay, so Italy, Italy's capitulated. We got their equipment stockpile, which is phenomenal. Which will definitely ro run our war effort for quite some time. You have so many different types of equipment. Oh my god. So you're just kind of stuck right there. Hmm. Ooh, what's up? Let's try this. Get a little encirclement going over there. What about the rest of y'all? They're all just walking everywhere because who doesn't want to walk around Siberia? That doesn't sound terrible at all. Let's go attack there. What have you not achieved in your front line other than that one province? Oh, I guess that is the, um, the whole armies deal. The whole um, army group. So, in terms of Italy, though, what's going on with you? All good, maybe. Just kind of chilling. Whatever. So, if we could somehow. We need to move tr more troops to the Balkans. I have a feel since we took out Italy, I think maybe if we just leave them where they are, um, all will be okay. I do want to take Stevastopol. 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 Maybe we'll put four division, four, then one than eight. Because having one go through Crimea, I guess would kind of help. Hmm. How have we not taken out Bulgaria? Please just destroy these divisions. Yeah, we just have trouble with um, Manus War because it's so big. Ooh, we can get six more uh, we can get six more Soldiers for you. Did you uh, get promoted? I don't know. He might have gotten promoted. Regardless, we'll get you some new troops. Uh, is it you? Yeah, that's that's who they're assigned to. Yep. Okay. So that is very good. More, yeah, let's get the super heavy tanks, because we'll use those. Maybe. Ah. This is probably the latest I've ever played Hoi 4, like, in, in terms of the date. Why are we not pushing forward? Because I need to reorganize everything. So that's great. So I guess I'll just manually control everyone to go attack. Yeah, they can't stop me. I mean, we're not winning everyone. We're winning most of these. We're winning most of these fights. Yeah, I definitely... I need to redraw up some of the front lines. I need to get these jackasses out. Like, really? It, like, America, can you not contain them, please? Please. Um. 
I want you to stop. I want all of y'all to just maintain what you've achieved. More tanks. We we're getting through the Sparty. Let's get let's get more jet fighters. Because we definitely need those. I'm going to reassign you back to your original army. So all of y'all are going to leave. And the Marines are going to hold you. Hopefully. Hopefully the Marines hold the line. Because if we lost Italy, that would be embarrassing. Okay, what the hell is going on here? Do not let them... Do not let there be a Battle of the Bulge type deal over here. Please. So... It appears we are pushing forward to get. No, do not. No, save the cutoff divisions. Seriously. Save them all. Save the rebellion. Save the dream. So. This is literally an island. This is an island that is going to bother me. Uh, go repair. Yeah. If, if, if we're getting attacked, then just go fix your ships. Fix your ship. <laughs> but, um... Let's have... Let's have... Yeah, let's have these guys come do an offensive line. Getting them... Put that thing back where it came from, or so help me. <laughs> Let's do it. Do all of that. Question is, are we going to lose Italy? Possibly. Regardless, where would be a good defensive line? Right here. Along this river. Let's do all of that. We are building more military factories. I do want to build rocket sites eventually. But I also want all these forts. So let's do it. Let's get all the forts first. While they're being attacked, I won't do anything. But actually, that is all the time we have for this episode. So I'm going to take a break. I'm definitely going to redraw everything because we can push through. We can push through Russia. We can push up through the Balkans. And we can... Ooh, America! In Spain. Ooh. I want... I want to put those tanks there, but I need them to make sure Turkey stays safe. Um, damn, who else can we put? Can we take maybe one of these infantry armies? But they're so far away to redeploy... Ah, all this, all these decisions, man, it's, it's hard. But anyways, that's all the time we have for this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like, consider subscribing to the channel. Um, 67, 8, 68 million people have died in this war. That's not good. Um, at least most of them are on their side. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like, consider subscribing to the channel, follow me on Twitter, and check out my Patreon page. Thank you, so, thank you all so much for watching. Until the next one. This is Mikey Derpangulator signing out. See you, nerds.